One last question. I know Floyd Mayweather is, is kicking around the possibility of making a comeback. You and I have talked about it before. I know. I know you feel like me. I kind of, you know, kind of hope he just rides off into the yeah. sunset. Do you think he should come back? I mean, again, I know they're talking about a lot of money. They're throwing it at him. Is it wise for him to come back and, and you know, I mean, of course he's going to take the money, but I don't think after would, a legacy like that, I mean, he? first of all, I would personally, I'm torn. Like, I would love to see him come back yeah. for selfish reasons, just to watch him and enjoy him. But, you know, personally, like, I haven't seen a lot of guys walk away on top and, and leave with their legacy intact, leave with their brains intact, leave with their money intact. There's been guys who, you know, obviously left with their money, left with, you know, their faculties, but not a lot of guys are left on top. Mm -hmm. And he could be one of the guys to do it, so I would love him to stay gone for that reason. And he's, he's older, man, and this thing is hard. This thing is hard in your 20s. It's hard in your early 30s, much less mid to late, mid to late 30s. Mm -hmm. So for that reason, I would want him to stay away. But listen, man, Floyd's a competitor. Number 50 is right there. It's a lot of money to be made mm -hmm. that just with one decision come back. Yeah. So it's tough to say if he should do it, if he shouldn't. I don't think that's my place to say. But I'm going to just sit back and enjoy it, man. I think Floyd knows what he wants to do, and I, I think he'll make the right decision. Yo, know, having said that, he's competitive and this, that, and the other. You competitive, too. A little so, bit. Uh, just a little bit. Just a little bit. How, how do you know you'll be able to walk away when the time is right? I don't. Yeah. I don't. Yeah. I just know that, you know, I'm talking to talk that a lot of fighters have talked, which is, hey, I'm trying to work on my exit strategy. I'm trying to set myself up. Um, but one thing I believe, and I believe God will place it on my heart in a strong, strong way. Yeah when it's time to walk away. And I think I, I, I think I'll know it. I've talked to retired athletes and you know, people who transition to, you know, other things in their life and they they all say the same thing. So you just know. But the question is, will you will you listen to that voice when it comes? Yeah. And I'm gonna have my day to make that decision. And hopefully you can do the right thing. Message for the fans, they, they all want you back in, in, in June, July, sometime in the summer. Man, just hey, I appreciate you rocking with me. I, like as always, man, I, I see you. I can't respond to everybody. Um, I can't reach out and touch everybody, but I do what I can do. I love you. I appreciate y'all. And uh, 2016, God willing, man, it's going to be our year. It's going to be a major year for us. Team Ward, SOG Nation. Let's go. Follow them on Twitter, Instagram, Facebook, all but not on Snapchat. I'm not. Snapchat is <laughs> for them young kids, man. <laughs>